I wish that people truly understood, opera singers truly understood to what extent, if they truly fixed their diction and their conception of what diction is, they would fix 90% of the vocal, so sad vocal problems that they think they have, especially starting from the very ABC of Italian singing, which is bel canto. So check out this coaching I did with Russian-based David Bolshoi on Rodolfo's Viraviso Luogiameni from Bellini's La Sonnambula. If you just nail the diction, if you just get the diction right, you will start singing well because the piece will tell you how it wants to be sung. And it's something that you will never be able to do without ever again in your life. Hear me out. Choose to only do it with your ear and not to spread your mouth a lot when you open the vowels. Con quai bad? No need to. Con quai bagli occhi. I don't need to see anything. That's what we call coverage of the vowel. That's the real coverage of the vowel. The concealing of the vowel. It's not quai, but quai. Quai. Con quai bagli occhi. Get used to separate the diction from the physical actions of your mouth. The diction has to be in here and checked by this thing that you have here. Okay? The diction is between here and here, here and here, here and here. The diction is everywhere but here. Everywhere but here. Okay? Otherwise, you'll mm -hmm. rah, 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 and all these movements of the mouth, they will physically affect the waves of voice that come out of your mouth, and they will affect the pitch. So the pitch yeah. will start being because the more we physically touch the waves with the opening and closing of our mouths, the more the pitch will become wavering and unstable. So never this. That's the coverage. Like a Renaissance painting, okay? <laughs> all smooth, all plain. I'm serious. I'm serious because it favors the steadiness of the line. Make the recordings because they save a lot of time during the sessions. A lot of time. And if you really have nailed the prosody and all the little details that make the legato, that make the elegance, legato and elegance have the very same matrimon, that make the elegance of the phrase, then singing is absolutely consequential. But they have to sink in deeply. So you have to just by osmosis go through them and go through them and go through them a lot. So do use the recordings. I send you, okay? Make the best out of them. It's very important. I mean, they're part of my method and uh, they've proven to be um, extremely um, helpful for memorization and for these very little things that make the legato and ultimately are the very foundation of the vocal line, okay? Mm -hmm. It's the smoothness of the consonants. It seems like we're wasting time, but it's so crucial what you're doing for the rest of your career. Because if these consonants are right, they will favor the legato, they will favor a deeper appoggio, a deeper breathing, and the bel canto will come easier and everything will, will become easier. And it's all in the diction. It's all in the way you conceive the diction. If you, if you, if you give a stroke on that M that's not supposed to be there, you will change the shape of the phrase and you will make the coloratura that follows much harder and not as uh, liquid as it's supposed to be because it's what it means, you know? And go straight uh -huh. in the vowel, not amua, but ama, ama, ama. O luoghi amani. O luoghi amani. A conjunction and the a verb very close together. You have no idea how important these details are in the professionalism of a singer and how many huge professional opera singers cannot tell the difference of pronunciation between the a conjunction and the a verb. And it's that's terrible. Mm -hmm. La sposa 
è quella because it's on these chiaroscuri that the whole concept of opera is born as an art as a visual art because it has a visual component in the diction e la sposa è quella è gentile leggiadra molto eh? e, sorry e la sposa e è try e è e è e è the symmetry, the pattern is everything here. It's like your painting, it's like an impressionist uh, uh, painting. So every stroke of the brush is scientifically precise. A qual tu sei, mandatory doubling, double S, sul mattino, mandatory doubling, double S after the commas. A qual tu sei, sul mattino, sul mattino dell'età era adesso double s qual tu sei double s sul mattino dell'età era adesso qual tu sei sul mattino dell'età they're all placed in conditions those, those s's that have to be doubled and so they, 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 that have to create that have to match each other and create a pattern and that's how it's done that's the whole point of it. That's why we're... Cosa? The, I cannot tell that you're not Italian if you say it like this. Say it again, for my pleasure. E la sposa è quella. È quella. Quella is closed. È, è quella. È quella. Perfect, è because quella. he matches illa with quella and that tells you how important the doubling is the raddoppiamento because if you don't say la sposa la sposa correctly with the closed a and the double l it will not match and it will not create a pattern with quella la sposa è quella illa illa and so if only if you see it correctly, then you can perceive the symmetry and the pattern. And bel canto is frequently based on these diction things. The important that you understand that the whole purpose of what we of what we're doing is to create a spell for the audience, to create an acoustic patterns that constitute a, constitutes a spell for the audience. So if from the very beginning you go, you go vera viso, the ear of the listener already goes, oh, he knows what he's doing, he can sing, he's telling me something, he's putting a spell on me. Because 99% of the people you will sing this to will not understand the meaning of a vira viso luoghi ameni, uh, probably 90% of Italians will not understand the literal meaning of a vira viso luoghi ameni, but they will understand instead the pattern and the symmetry and the order that is in that double V, double V, vira viso. Do you hear how it sings for itself when the diction is precise? I mean, if you just nail, the, if you just do the diction correctly, I there is nothing else that I can, that I have to correct you vocally. Singing <laughs> bel canto equals to singing the diction correctly. When you nail the diction, everything else in the phrase, everything I'm speaking of, everything goes into place automatically. This is how important it is. What you're doing? Della prima, della prima gioventù. That's it. Keep going. Era adesso a qual tu sei sul mattino, sul mattino dell'età. Bravo David, you have no idea how hard it is what you're doing for your ear. But you are learning things you will thank me for like 20, 30 and 40 and 50 years from now. When you will still be singing, okay? 
because they will give an elegance to your singing that you have no clue about right now. Okay?